Hi, I'm Flora. And I'm Riley. And we're part of the online pitch. We know that when you get home, you feel tired, lazy, and you're just stressed out from school. But you're hungry. But you don't want to waste time thinking of what to make, to eat, and then actually making it. So today, um, we're basically going to be teaching you how to make a candy bar pie. And it only takes about five minutes to make. Um, and it's really yummy. It's a lot of fun. Okay, so, um, Flora, why don't you tell us what we need to make the candy bar pie? Okay, well, first you'll need pie crust. We chose chocolate, but you can have any type of pie crust. You'll need instant pudding, vanilla or chocolate. We chose vanilla. You'll need milk, one and one-fourth cup. Um, you'll need a bowl, cutting board, a whisk, and a spoon. And you'll also need um, one whole thing of Cool Whip. We, we like the extra creamy brand. And then you'll need one and a half bars of your favorite candy bar. After washing your hands, we're going to start off with the pudding. You're going to put two bags of pudding in the bowl. And then add your milk. And you're going to want to stir. And after you stir it for a while, you're going to want to add the Cool Whip. You're going to want to empty half of the Cool Whip bottle in the bowl. And you can either use the um, the bottle tub Cool Whip or the tubs of it, either one. So you're going to stir everything together for five minutes. After five minutes, it should look nice and fluffy like this. Okay, so after you're done stirring your liquid mixture, you want to um, take your two candy, you want to have one and a half of your favorite candy bar, and what you want to do is um, just chop it up into tiny pieces. So you want to take your chocolate and just cut it up so it's nice and small. And just cut that up there. Okay, cut. After you've chopped up the candy bar, you're going to put some of it into the pudding. And you want to save about a handful for later. And just stir it. Together. You tell, so it's a nice even mixture. After you've stirred the candy bar chunks into the pudding, you're going to want to place it into the pie crust now. And just put all of the pudding in and even it out. So after you're done placing the pudding mixture into your pie crust, you want to take the rest of your Cool Whip, there should be about half a can left, and you just want to put it all on top of it. You can decorate it, make it nice, so it can look like a pie, a real pie. Then when you're done covering it, you can take what you've saved of your candy bar and place it on top to decorate it. And this is how your pie is going to look like when you're done. Then when you're done, you can cut a piece and test it out and see how it tastes. Thanks for watching. This has been Florin Riley and Nikos for the, with the online pitch. Mm -hmm.